Hey Lightweights and welcome back to some more Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Uh, last video we figured out who the traitor was for Soma uh, and we chose Galen and from the comments you guys said that that was the correct choice so I'm really glad that I got that right because that would have been horrible if I killed the wrong person. Um, so yeah, he was definitely the traitor. He just seemed guilty. I had come across some evidence that I didn't even realize I came across um, when I was exploring the world and that just made him seem more and more guilty. So that wasn't too bad or too difficult, even though I was panicking about it. We also got a wolf in our camp, Dewolfka. Uh, he's super cute. Um, so you'll notice him wandering around our camp if you didn't watch last video. And I think that's pretty much all we did. Um, so I'm gonna pick up at Ravensthorpe. I'm going to unlock the next area. I do have a task I can do for Valka. Uh, you guys said that that is what's needed to go to Asgard, which I didn't know that you could go to Asgard, so that wasn't spoilers. Um, but I wasn't sure how, so apparently I have to do some stuff for her to be able to go to Asgard. I'm going to hold off on that for now. I'm really excited to see Asgard, and I'm really excited to, I don't know, just see what it's like and how they explain us going there. Um, but I'm gonna hold off on that for now just cause I wanna make some more headway in the main missions, the main story missions. Um, so I'm just going to focus on those for today. I did do some side missions off camera. I know originally I had said I was gonna try to save those but it was just completely overwhelming looking at all of those on the map. Um, so I don't remember exactly what I did. I did finish the guy with the wallop. Um, you guys told me that you could parry him. I didn't parry, I just kept dodging and that was working really well for me. Um, but for those of you who haven't done the wallop side mission yet, make sure you parry because apparently it does a decent amount of damage to him. Um, but I found just kind of dodging to the side and waiting for him to, after he did the wallop, he kind of just like stumbled a bit and that would be my time to attack. So I did that off camera, no problem. Um, and then I also started doing some of the anomalies. You guys said in the comments that um, I should do the final anomaly on camera. Um, I decided to just do the first one just to see what it was like. And it doesn't seem like there's really anything story or anything exciting that you guys would want to watch anyways. It's more of like an obstacle course trying to figure out how to get to the top. Um, so I really don't think those would be very entertaining to watch on camera. I will save the last one though, like you suggested. Uh, thank you to whoever suggested that, but I'll save the last anomaly for on camera. Um, like I said, if there are any specific side missions you can think of that you want me to do on camera, let me know. I'd be happy to do those. Um, but I do think I'm going to either just not do the side missions or do them off camera um, just because for sake of time, I feel like I'll be recording this game for a year anyways. <laughs> if you add the side missions on there, I'm never going to finish the game. Um, so if there's specific ones, tell me the location, um, roughly where in that location I can find it, and I'll definitely try my best to do those on camera for you. And with that said, I have gone on long enough. I'm wrapping my, my Grogu ugly Christmas sweater, even though it can't be ugly because it's got Grogu. He's so cute. Um, and also, I don't know if you can tell, but I like purpleified my hair and you totally can't tell in this light it just looks like it's dark but it's kind of purple which is cool so you might see shades of that and now I'm really done just make sure you subscribe to the channel hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post the next video all right here we go all right so I need to go talk to forget her name. But anyways, we're gonna go open up the next area of the map. Um, Brandy, that's it. <laughs> that never happened. What do you got for me, Randy? Nice to see you. Nice to see you too. Word of our growing settlement has reached outside ears, so have a look around. You may see a few new faces. We are allied with the Danes of Grandabridshire. Their Jalskona, Soma, has pledged an oath. Well done, Eivor. These early victories will pay off well. They will, in more than one way. One of Soma's finest fighters, Birna, has pledged her blade to us. She's a powerful fighter and a charming spirit. I think she'll fit in nicely. Glad to have her. Good work. Maybe she can find someone who won't fence on her here. Eivor, a word of note. Someone has set up shop outside. A trader, I believe. 
When you can, ask him his business here. He seems to represent the larger guild. The child's eyes, or the eyeless children? Eyeless children? No, that cannot be right. Ask him yourself. Okay, cool. I will, but first, can we pick a new place? I want to see the Alliance map. I love that little trill in the song. It reminds me of the um, Frozen sequel. There's a song that's in there. Okay, I should probably do the 20, right? <laughs> Let it just sure. Let it Chestershire? Tell me more about Letta Chestershire. I should Letta like to join Sigurd soon. He traveled to a town called Repton to meet Uba and Eva Ragnarsson. As I hear it, they are on the verge of exiling the current king of Mercia with the hope of installing a king of their own. A bold endeavor. I should be there to help however I can. I think you should. I won't keep them waiting. Good. I will send word to Sigurd and the Ragnarsons, pledging your assistance. If I were you, I would go by ship. Repton is quite a distance north on the river Or Trent. I could go by fast travel point, because I already unlocked it. <laughs> okay, let's go talk to this merchant first. Let's see who's, who this is. Not so glad you. To see you. Who are we talking to? Oh yeah, I saw you. I was wondering Good who day. you were. A new customer. Whether I am or not, I'm the one you'll speak with. Ranvi tells me you are merchants. Ah, hello, hello. Are you the leader of this bustling encampment? We come on behalf of a thousand eyes. I tried to do the right thing. Of uncommon goods and exotic treasures from all corners of the world. If you need it, we have it. If we don't have it, you don't need it. Such is our place. He's an origin. I see. How is he still a kid? Is this child with you? Child? Child? My Oops. friend, you look upon the master of the thousand eyes. Crap, what was his name? Of our guild. A legend. A hero of the people. And the richest merchant west of the Indus. You look upon... Oh, uh, Reda. You mean... Reda? I always said Reda. He does, Eivor Wolfkist. It is a pleasure to meet you at last. Hmm. You seem familiar, but you wouldn't seem familiar to Eivor, but that's okay. You seem strangely familiar. Perhaps I know you. We have met in another life. Oh but my god, I love that! I have a common face. And what is it I can do for you, or you for me? It's quite simple. For a fee, I can connect you to a shadow market that stretches from the... I wonder what the, um, to the currency for this will be. What sort of fee? It varies with the item. But there is a small hitch. Through this market, all prices are paid hmm. in I think I have a decent amount of opal from exploring. What a strange color it has. May I hold it? You may hold it and keep it, Eivor. A gift from Reda for your immeasurable hospitality. Now look here. Browse what wares I have on offer. Okay. Sorry, I have like a hair or something in my mouth. <laughs> I don't know what that was. Gross. Anyways. 120. Oh yeah, I got enough of those. Oh. Well, sorry. I can't afford anything. Nothing I only have 67. No matter. My selection changes daily. You will soon find something you like. Gotta now say that. you are friends with me, you are also a friend of the Thousand Eyes as well. And what does this mean? Observe my outfit, not the scarf I wear. As you travel, you will meet many of my associates clad in these same vestments. These are my people, my other Excuse eyes. Me. Seek them out for trade or contracts. Oblige them, 
and you will earn a tidy sum. And I might even feel inclined to reward you myself. An interesting offer. Good to hear. Now, if you'll excuse us, my apprentice has a tent to secure. You're staying for a while, I suppose. Oh, yes, and you needn't even thank me. <laughs> we would be honored to call this our home. Good day. All right. We just got 50 opal for that. Huh. Cool. What was that quest that just popped up? Oh, okay. All right, so you might also notice that my camera is in a different spot. I finally got a new desk instead of the hand-me-down desk I had been using before. I don't need to use the ship, I can fast travel. Duh. Um, anyways, and because of that, I have a whole new setup and my camera can actually be in the spot that I want it to be in. So it'll be obviously a more direct view instead of an off to the side view, which I had to have before because of the, the way everything had to be set up. So I hope you guys like it. If not, too bad, because that's how it's going to be. Just kidding. Um, yes, I've been here already, obviously. Secret should be here with the Renaissance. Um, I'm trying to think of some of the side missions I did. There was one out here with, like, a Viking that was too old to be a Viking. So he was, like, living on his own in an island making music. So I, like, brought him his instruments and stuff. Go, my eyes. Okay, so it's probably in there. Um. No! Oh, that doesn't sound good. Who stands before Eva Ragnarsson? Are you Sigurd Drenger? Uh, Igor! Eivor. If you keep that up, I'll stain the floors. The place could use some color. <laughs> Who are they? All spies. Dressed to look the part of a peasant. Got feisty. Pitchfork. From this rabid little one. Was a time when you met and slew your enemy on the field before they could dream of things like sending spies! And now we shake hands and make deals. Not my thing. I figured. He's a little crazy. I love them whipped, weeping, and reeking of piss. Hey! Good boy. You're free, Saxon piggy, to run amok through the Mercian fields. Oh. I would have let him down easy. Follow me. I don't think I like this guy. I'll give you the tour. <laughs> that could be pretty accurate for the Vikings, but I don't think I like what it. What do you call this place? Makes me I very call uncomfortable. It the shit to the Mercians, it is Repton. Their most revered kings are buried below the church. Imagine their weeping when we drove them out. You plunge your knife deep into the heart of this kingdom. That is right. We've got a number of Saxon nobles lined up with their lips puckered, ready to kiss our asses. The only holdout is King Burgred and his war thane, Leofred. But my brother is brewing a plan to deal with them. I take it that's where we'll find my brother. Right. Talkers they are, Uba and Sigurd. Might want to dig the wax from your ears. Oh. 
Lotna. Lotna, say it. Vilket ord? Don't play me for a fool, Abba. I know Bergrids. I'm not going anywhere, Bakrut. You have the king on his heels because of me. Because of my men. For which you were Ooh. paid. But that price does not change because you have caught a whiff of our Hexilver horde. You forget I am a sellsword. I ask what I please, and I take what I'm owed. If I wanted to hear you talk shit, I'd gouge out your tongue and shove it up your ass. <laughs> now fuck off. <laughs> okay, that was a cool line. Haggling over silver is a bad look for the son of Ragnar Lothbrok. But worry not, Uba. I have the warriors you need. If this is one of them, my worries have vanished. Eivor, wolf kissed. You have come at just the right time. Upa and Ivar here are hunting a king. And when we've caught him, we mean to crown another. Our dear Thane Shellwolf here. It's not a role I begged for, but it's what Mercia needs just now. A man to fairly rule both Saxons and Danes. I can't imagine the current king is too happy about all this. Burgred is furious, of course, <laughs> but this is our new reality. And I won't sit idly while he drags our kingdom through the dirt. The king has refused our offers of peace. Jailwolf means to change that. There'll be a new king for a new England. For now, Burgred is holed up in his fortress at Tamworth, making a final stand. Another shithole. <laughs> Only further south. Is anything not a shithole there for weeks to no effect? So, no more knocking. Now we batter the gate to splinters. If we take Tamworth, pretty eyes. remove Burgred and crown Shellwolf, come morning the Shire is ours. And Mercia soon after. Yes, remove. I cannot stress that enough. Burgred is not to be harmed. My legitimacy as king hangs on this one simple fact. Uh, you rob all the joy from war, Saxon. Not every victory needs to be marked by the slaughter of a king. I mean... But it is much better. His request is fair, Ivar, and we will honor it. But what happened? Like, what are you going to do with him, though? <laughs> this is a good plan, brother. I am ready for the coming fight. Agreed. Yet remember this. Whatever you stand to gain here, so do we. An alliance between my clan and Mercia's crown. See this man installed on his throne and you will have it. I swear. The bold sons of Ragnar bellow to sound the spear din and the thunder of shields. So let fall the arrow storm. The battle begins. Ah! You never said this one was a poet. <laughs> I need to piss. We have a forward camp the just north champion. of Tamworth. <laughs> Will you go with us? Lead the way. Take in the sights of Repton if you like. We will be at the docks when you are ready to go. I'm glad you and your brother have come. If only to bring some measure of calm. Ease yourself, Cheowulf. We all stand to benefit. And you'll be remembered for this for years to come. For all the wrong reasons, I fear. Sorry, I keep yawning. I have slept like shit the past two nights because I have a stupid cold. <clears throat> Not COVID related. A lively town. Quite a lot to see here. Yes, but I've already seen it all. Although, where is that? Hmm. Oh, it must be talking about that one out there. Okay. Um. Just like a stupid sore throat and congestion. And as you know, colds are always worse at night when you're trying to sleep. Because <laughs> that's always the way. So I have not been sleeping. So, some of us are staying behind as I hit it. Half the army's already in Tamworth, and we've now got help from the south. It's our lot to look after this place now, to protect her. Shame. 
It's like an obstacle course running through here. <laughs> zig and zag. Oh shit, they're running on there. Oops. Southeast. Bring the men to the gates of Tamworth. We'll flood the fields and Eivor. Is your axe sharpened? I'm ready for the spear din. The ooh, ooh. Thunder of shields, yes. It's good to have you with us. To fight beside such legends is an honor. I've only heard tales of your conquests. Now I get to live them. We'll weave our sagas together. Thread upon thread. Come on, boy. We'll forge a man from your softness. Who's that? Hammered on the anvil of does war. does not need to fight to be Move. a... Move! Move! Call me, Var. The fight's not here. Aye. The fight is nowhere to be found in this boy. A boy who happens to be Chilwolf's son. Why is he not in his quarters? Our future king wants a battle-hardened heir. Time he proves his worth, don't you think? Yikes, that's gonna suck. <sighs> not yet crowned king and already grooming his successor. That shows some boldness. Right. And bold kings need bolder sons. Ivar! He comes with us. And should anything happen to this little sprout, I will bear the punishment our future king inflicts. He'll want to remove your head. Ha <laughs> ha, you hear that, boy? You die, and I'll have to kill your father, too. Oh, this guy's crazy. Mount up, Eivor. It's a long ride to Tamworth. This is not my horse. <laughs> I don't know whose horse this is, but it's not mine. He always finds new ways to humor himself. I'll keep that in mind. And both eyes open. You smell that, Chailbert? The stink of jealousy of our budding friendship, I think. What is Jailwolf's son doing in Repton at all? It's Jailwolf's way of proving his loyalty. And there's no safer place for a traitor and his son <laughs> in the middle of a pack of Danes. Say from who? You and Ivar seem to have brought the Shire <laughs> to hell. The beards are with us, the common folk. But Burgred still has his soldiers all over Mercia. They're devoted to him, and they'll die defending him. Voice, Eivor. You sound different than the brothers. Good ear, Lord. Most in England cannot tell the difference. But not all Danes are Danes. From where do you come, if I may ask? North of the Danelands. A place called Funberg, in Norway. I didn't know there was land north of there. What are the people like? You ever see a herd of sheep follow each other off the edge of a cliff? They're like that. The ones who remained, anyway. Couldn't have said it wow. better myself. Was this a mass exodus from Norway, then? It was. Norway is now the province of a young king, Harold by name. A boy wise beyond his years. Are you not angry that he has displaced you and so many others? I was, for a time. But our weeks at sea have softened my brow fire. If I am honest, I realize I quite admire King Harold. By words and by weapons, both. He has pacified the country I call home. For the first time in any man's memory, or any scald song, Norway has one king. Just one. And that is quite a feat. That is impressive, truly. England is half the size of Norway, and yet we have four kings for our four kingdoms. You see? How could I not be impressed? No, Harold is a good man with grand ideas. I can see that now. I am only six years his junior, and have yet to see my first battle. I cannot imagine the skill and cunning he has. Your first battle is coming, young Gilbert. From this day on, you may see rapid progress. I'm not sure I want so swift a rise. <laughs> yeah, true, because if you rise pretty too quickly, that means your dad probably In died. In truth, Gilbert, it is my father who bears the heaviest weight of my anger, not King Harold. My father gifted my birthright to Harold without my consent or knowledge. As easily as if he might hand over a battle with me. It was not merely a deception. It was a betrayal of trust. The prick of which still stings me. Be it a blessing or a curse, 
family is always first. A good line, boy. Were you not an Adeling, I would hire you as my skull. Scold? It sounds something like Scott, our court poets. Is that what you mean? Right again. Fascinating. The harmony between our words and yours is quite something. As if we were distant cousins, separated by an ocean of time as well as space. <laughs> I like the thought of that. I do. Um, I like how interested he is in the culture and wanting to actually get to know them as a people and understand them. I wonder if that will come into play later. I keep forgetting I moved my camera and I keep going to look at where the camera used to be and it's not there and then I'm like It's gonna take some getting used to I was hoping if I went faster they would go faster now that the conversation is done but apparently that is not how it works What are they doing? Cheering about something. Ooh. Hey! Yeah. <laughs> I think they're excited for the fight. Look at these pagan rats. Ravenous, unseemly beasts teeming over holy ground. Have a care, Lord. These pagan rats are numbers. I can see that. What happened to him? What do we do about them? I advise we strongly consider their demands, Lord. We won't survive a fight. Is that you, Leofrit? How quickly you recover. I'm beginning oh. to wonder if it is a man or a god beneath all that armor. A man of God stands before you, Eva. Proud and resolute. That's Burgred's war thing. Killed a dozen of our men in an ambush along the River Trent. It was Ivar's axe that stopped him. That is a poor description of a perfect 30-yard toss. <laughs> Enough jawing, heathens! Speak your peace! We've come for your crown, Lord. With or without your head attached. Ha, I admire your ambition, pagan. But what you ask is impossible. No Dane ever has, or ever will, occupy Mercia's sacred throne. Mm. Would you settle for a Norse? We're not as gentle, but we're much better poets. <laughs> <laughs> Norse, Dane, dog, you're all the same to me, all godless. My king. May I suggest a more measured approach to this? <laughs> I grow weary of this palaver. You have trampled our lands, toppled our monuments. We've given you silver, fed your people. And yet in spite of all this, your encroachment on my kingdom continues. No more. We will die defending what is ours, whatsoever the cost. I mean, I get why he's pissed. my crown, Uber Ragnarsson, you must pry it from the hands of my bloodless corpse. Man the walls! This is one of those games where it's like... You you Look do it and you want to do it because you're playing the character the that's man. doing it, but also... We're taking like, Tamworth tonight! I understand why the other people are fighting hey, against Lord. us and sometimes I feel Tell a little the guilty. Captain we're ready to march. <gasps> Ivar and I will round up the men. You know your way around a batsman rap. I've seen them in action. I want you at the helm of ours. Strong and agile. I'll be there. As will I. So I did actually, I think I went in there. Yeah, I went in there to try to get this stupid tattoo. Literally cleared the entire place and then died going after the tattoo because I accidentally fell off. <laughs> it like fell off a wall or something stupid like that. And or left off a wall, probably left off something, and died. And then they were all back, and I was like, I'm not doing that again. So I'm glad that 
<laughs> I'm glad that we cleared out as part of a mission because that was really annoying. And so is my yawning. Drive me crazy. Who are you? Who am I? I'm with the Reconnaissance. Who it's am I? It's time to roll out the battering ram. Birgit wanted to fight. Now we'll give him one. Are you ready to march now? Let's go. It's time to capture a kingdom. Did you guys recognize that Disney movie? That quote that I just said? It was a quote. What I wasn't just saying it. What are going to do about him? Jail death. Something wrong. I know these men, Eivor. I've supped with them. Not two weeks ago, Leofrith showed me how to wield a greatsword. Mm. He's a friend. Friendships end, often at the point of a spear. It cannot be that cold. Least of all with Leofrith. He is only following orders. When the march begins, find an empty tent and stay there. Do not think me a coward. I am not afraid of war. I do not want to kill my friends. There's no other way. Fight or hide. It's up to you. Sometimes we have crazy eyes. Maybe he can go with us and, like, talk to Leo first. You know what I'm talking about. And, like, convince him, like, hey, listen, come to our side. Oh, where'd that guy come from? Did he just fall 
to his death? That's mean, I shouldn't be laughing, but that was funny. Where are they? I didn't mean to set a trap. I was trying to use my Odin sight. Okay. Oh, okay. I got this. I got this. Oh, I don't got this. There we go. Oh, yes! Love! Oh! I've had enough of you. Sir! Who's throwing shit at me? That was so much easier with a whole group of people. <laughs> it's over, Burkret. Lay down your weapons and surrender. Mm. Where'd he go? Take three men and search the rear. Look around. There must be a secret tunnel. See what you can find. Just like Soma had. I'll send for Chael Wolf. Tell him we found a throne. If Eva's gonna give it up. Ah, that was a good scuffle. Hmm? But I did nice. notice we were short one eye. Burgard's journal. Today I learned the one they call ha Half Dan has left Mercia and put his brothers in charge. Moved on as if dethroning me was all but a sure thing. He could not be more wrong. The he heathens Shieldbed can keep Repton. It may be you missed him. Your lies are just like you, Eivor. Big and bold. I did not know who was talking to me. Sorry about that, guys. No idea what he just said. <laughs> I thought he was uh, talking to somebody else. Okay. Uh, moved on. Blah, blah, blah. The heathens can keep Repton. Dig up Mercia's kings and scatter their bones for all I care. I will not be shaken by these feeble attempts to damage my reputation. They think they can turn my people against me. No. Mercians everywhere will fight for their king, whether they want to or not. Lord, I hope this letter finds you well. You have my gratitude and my promise that these men will not be called upon unless absolutely necessary. We continue to fend off the Danish incursions and will do so without respite. Aethel Swift sends you her regards. She is well, though like my war thane, I wonder if she too has begun to doubt our ability to win this war. No matter, it is I who let it, who lead it, and I will defend my state to the bitter end. Faith in God, the Lord King of Mercia. Burgred call for help. Enlisted the aid of powerful men. But who are these warriors he speaks of? I'm sure we will find out soon enough. <sighs> to the Almighty King. Ooh, that's cool. We have an agreement, that is, if by the time this message arrives, it is still your arse that warms the seat of Mercia's throne. Here is what I know. The Ragnarsons have been speaking with one of your own. Chaelwolf is his name. Together they are devising a plan to overthrow you and install him in your stead. A Norse named Sigurd has arrived and allied with the brothers. An attack is soon to follow. Ready your men. As for your secret haunts, they are safe for now, but keeping them that way will cost you. I await your reply. Only this time, send a more fair-faced envoy. Mm. 
chronicle of payments made. Like a ledger. There's a symbol here. Clan emblem, maybe. The brothers should see this. Ivar, I found a letter. There's a symbol here. Fake. Your men have any luck? Nothing. You? This. Do you know that symbol? Tona Sigil. It seems she's been dealing with Burgred as well. The wretch. She was the That's mercenary the lady with the Repton, yes? Yep, okay. She's playing both sides of this war. She could have told him anything. Sold him secrets about me, about Repton. Our plans. Why bother with all this pageantry? Fashion a new crown and stick it on your melon. There you have it. You're the new king. <laughs> that is not how it works. Not in Mercia. <sighs> We're wasting time. Tona is our only lead. We talk to her, find out what she knows. I would sooner launch my face into my axe than face her. That might improve her impression of you. <laughs> we have the same father, Eivor. But his mother was a sow. Meet us at Tona's camp when you're finished here. And bring your patience. And your axe! Eivor, <laughs> a word. He creeps me out, but he's kind of funny. Go, I'll catch up. I will join the brothers, Eivor. Meet us at Tonas. My son told me what happened earlier, with Ivar pressuring him to fight. He said you intervened. You would be mourning your son if I hadn't. He's not a fighter. No, but he should be. By trial or by training. He'll come around in time, but keep him from Ivar if you can. He's the furthest thing from a mentor. <laughs> yeah, you do not want that guy to be a mentor. It's a bad plan. Nice. Okay, so I think I can get... Maybe. Maybe I can get this now. I'm so bad at these for no reason. Really? Really? Okay, door. Meet your match. Okay. Anyways. Um can I climb up this? I don't remember. Yes. Okay. It's like I either do really well with them or I do like Oh, it's not even up here. Where is it? Or I do very horribly with them. Tattoo, where are you? Um. I'll take on all comers. Maybe this isn't the one I was thinking. Oh no, it is. Okay. Got it. Yes, this was the one I fell to my doom at. See? Why? <laughs> oh, we're not going that way. Okay, through the door. I can recover. I can recover. I can't recover. It's gone. I lost it. Damn. <laughs> Alright, I'll get that off camera. You guys don't need to watch how pathetic I am. But like sometimes I feel like I jump and I must just not be at quite the right angle because I just do not work, go where I'm supposed to be going. Anyways. I'll do that later. Where's uh, oh it's over here, there. I'm a little bit blind. Um, it's probably just as quick if I go this way. I did clear this part out fine. <clears throat> Before. 
but clearly it didn't matter. Makes me wonder how many other places I've cleared that I'm just gonna have to wipe out again. Oh, I do have skill points. I got this new skill I'm really excited to try. This one. Left bumper. I need to remember to do that. I wonder if it will work with arrows. So I did all those. What's this one? Oh, that could be nice. Hmm. Looting a chest or pickpocketing. I don't think I've ever pickpocketed. <laughs> ever. That could be cool. There's just so many that seem awesome. Oh, well, I do want that. Let's work our way towards that adrenaline upgrade. <clears throat> um, so what's going to be the fastest way there? This way, for sure. Yeah. One. Two. Okay, cool. Anyways, <laughs> back to our regularly scheduled programming. Oh shit, I don't want my horse yet. Hi, buddy, I haven't seen you in a while. Well, okay, maybe we can go down this way. Oh, we're stuck. We're stuck on a ledge! Okay. There we go. This area is really pretty. I love those wildflowers. Random horse chilling there. Oh, wolves. Listen, people, you do not want this fight. Trust me. All right, horse, really? <laughs> Figure it out. Oh my god, you're so slow on hills. I can't take it. Just keep your wits about you. Come, buddy. Me and Ava will take care of this. Sigurd, is there a problem? We'll go see Tomna. Just the two of us. Eva and Oba will wait here. Better if Tomna thinks we've come alone. The truth is, I don't think any of us can stop Eva from cleaving her head open. <laughs> it's all he was spewing the whole way over here. Right. He Shall does we? love to we'll spew people shortly. open. A small fortune for whoever sent Tona to hell. I'll hold you to that. From what I overheard in Repton, the brothers had an arrangement with Tona. What happened? She's a mercenary. Uba used her for man and information. But that relationship soured now that Burgret is all but defeated. From what I heard, Tona has hunger for two things. Soft silver and a stern hump. <laughs> Neither of which earns you true loyalty. If she can't be trusted, what use is she? That is for us to find out. We may be able to satisfy her. And if we can't? Eva did tell you to bring your axe. I like Sigurd. And here they are, as expected. If she takes a liking to you, keep talking. She's more your type, I think. Sigurd, <laughs> what brings you strong? Eva's like, listen, I don't want any of that. I suspect you already know. Yes. The embers on the air betray you. And yet, if you are here talking to me, King Burgeret remains at large. And who are you, lovely dove? Want to perch your ass on my lap? Mm. Not interested. And why not? I've been told I have a rather expert tongue. 
Only good for your ping, I see. <laughs> Enough blabbering. You know why we're here. Where is King Burgret? That is what you want. And what makes you think I have the slightest idea? We found letters. Records of trade. The two of you have a history. What can I say? The king pays well for my services. If only I could say the same for those two Ragnarsson clots. You're dealing with me now. And I want to know what you know. Name your price. Very well. I could use another cow. And you can cover the cost. When Cheowulf is on the throne, do you think he'll be pleased to hear you stood in his way? That you doubted him at all? Settle for half that amount and maybe Cheowulf's first command won't be for your head on a platter. Thank you, you for flighting. Out with it. Burgred paid me to steer the Ragnarsons clear of two areas, Ledechestre and Templebrochfort. It was a hefty amount. If I were you, that's where I'd look. And that is all I know. Not more, not less. We are done here. Ledestre and Templebroth Fort. Do you know these places? I don't, but the brothers will. I'll bring this news to them. Don't stay around here too long. We've got a king to catch. Aye, aye, Captain. At first, when she said she could use new cow, I thought she was referring to us, and I was about to go off on her. Call me a cow. Please. But then she meant a literal cow. <laughs> so, never mind. Oh, God. Do I call my horse over here? It's all hills. It's probably going to take longer if I ride my horse than if I walk. Oh, I also did this one side mission that was really funny where a girl said her brother was bewitched and turned into a fish and we needed to catch her brother and it was really just two kids trying to get out of their chores. It really cracked me up. Sigurd's told us the news. Well done. Let Estre and Templebroth fought. What do you know about them? Hmm. Ledechest is a large village. And Templebroch. It's an old military fort. Not much else. Burkrit could be at either one. We should check both as soon as possible. And what do we do with Tona? I would bet the sweat off my sack she's writing to Borgred now, offering silver for a warning about us. Let me worry about that. We should get moving, Dringir. I can take the fortress of Templebroch. I will join you, Sigurd. That leaves me led the Chester, then. All by my fucking lonesome. Just friend, as you brother. like it. Maybe Eivor dares to be called that. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with all of you soon. I feel like Sigurd... They clearly have a close relationship because... Sometimes I'm surprised Sigurd isn't offended that, like, Eivor's overstepping. Like, I feel like when he's there, a lot of times she, like, takes over and... Um, kind of, like, calls the shots and runs the show. So it just shows how close they are because I feel like if for anybody else, they'd be like, um, excuse me. This is, this is my show. This is what I'm doing. All right, let's go. Why does this one have a question mark in it? Is it cheating if I fast travel to the place? <laughs> I haven't unlocked the um, Roman artifact guy yet in our village. Oh my god, you guys. This cold is gonna be the death of me, I swear. Oi. Listen, I don't have time for you. So, you can go away now.
You don't see me. You don't see me. Have a look, Sunan. All right, he's up on that tower. Interesting. Uh-oh. Don't turn around, dude. I do like that they changed from like the original types of games where you could only climb certain parts to basically being able to climb anything. <laughs> Makes it much easier. I remember a couple times as Ezio, I was like, how do I get up there? Good timing. We would have stormed the place without you. We? What have you seen? Soldiers aplenty, wagons going in and out. That weasel Borgred is here, I'm sure of it. The bathhouse there and that church, see? I sent a scout to check them both. Should be back at any moment now. Did you see Uba and Sigurd in Templarbrach? No. And if Burgred is hiding here, I won't have to. There is a lot we would not have to do if we stuck to killing kings. Thanks to my brother, now we are into making them. Um... No small tension between you two. Thought you'd be more like-minded. You and Sigurd. You always see eye to eye? More often than not. You are still young. <laughs> you live to my age and you will see. The closer you get, the greater the stink that rises. Hmm. Is that foreshadowing? Time's up for your scout, I'd say. He's either dead or run off. Give him a chance. Can't risk them seeing us and Burkrit slipping away again. You stay here and wait for your scout. I'm going in. All right. Sometimes it's hard to see the hay bales in this game. Shit, we got someone with a key, which means I need that. Oh, fuck. It's gonna suck. <clears throat> this must be the bathhouse. Need to find a way inside. Oh shit, better sit down. Yes, I agree. <laughs> I like how that guy's just like, okay. I want that guy to go back that way so I can come up there. Maybe he's stupid and won't see me. Okay. Fighting to take Tamworth back from the Danes. We're to secure Definitely our already looted this place, so that's annoying. <laughs> the king's grown tired of him, you know. That's what all the men are saying. Tired? How do you mean? Are you blind? He questions Burgrid's orders every chance he gets. That's done ever since the Danes showed up. Hmm. your mind I feared you were one of them keep quiet what are you doing here I'm I was looking for Burgred you did he send him as the oh, I hoped God. I might find Burgred myself and talk him into surrendering but he's not in Lederchester how can you be sure Leofrith passed this way with some men I eavesdropped it seems they're only stockpiling food here but he did say something of interest 
gave orders to send more men to Burgred's wife, the Lady Arvelsworth. She's in Templebroch. She would know where Burgred's hiding. Do you hear that? The sounds of battle. Eva. Let's get you out of here now. Where are you going? I know my way around. We'll go through the market. This way. Oh, okay. Apparently he's leading now. Come up, Eva. Up. I'll stay oh. your welcome. Okay. Good night. Oh. They're everywhere. Stay close to me. What, what do I do? Fight, man. Fight. Eliminate the soldiers. All right, I can do that. Come on, Chael Wolf. Oh, what was that? I forgot I don't have my shield and I keep trying to block the arrows and that's, you know, can't do that anymore. God is with me. Where'd you go? Uh, really? Stomp. Oh. I can blend in with a crate? What the hell? Your last breath. Word. I burn it all down. Oh, shit, I got him. Oh, fuck, not again. Damn you! Chandler, get out of the no, fire! What are you no, doing? No. Oh. You're just standing there like a moron. Are you hurt? Speak up. I. I, don't <laughs> I just so. burned alive, but I think I'm oh fine. God. I didn't want it to come to this. It would have killed you, Chilbert. You had no choice. Now don't move. Where is your king, Saxon? Where is he? Lord our father, grant me salvation. <laughs> when does their god find the time to answer so much mumbling and whimpering? You're reckless, Ivar. Cheobert could have been killed. Who am I to stand in the light of a boy searching for his balls? Don't excuse yourself. You enjoy this too much. Stop. It wasn't Eva who sent me. I sent myself. What's wrong with his eyes? A caution, boy. Until your father is crowned your Mercia's enemy, not its champion. You understand? I understand. Good. Now return to Repton and remain there until we call. Will you not stay, Wolfkist? There is no king, but we have corpses to loot. Burgrit's lady Athelsweth is in Templebroth. I'm going to find out what she knows. Oh. Take everything. Damn. Oh, it's blending into the table over there, not the crate. Okay. <laughs> Pile the soldiers here. All right, can I get Let some food these first? people bear witness to the carnage that awaits their kingdom. Hmm. I don't really have any. Oops. I guess I might as well take my boat down, right? It's probably the fastest way. We're always facing the wrong way. <laughs> it's a conspiracy, I swear. Is Birna on here? Can't raise the sail yet. Okay. 
Can't raise the sail here. Can I now? What? We can use the sail here, Abel. Okay. Sail out! Continue later. Well, don't stop the song. What? What? Uh. Bring the mask down! Too many bridges. Mask up! Up, down, up, down. Shall we raise the sail over? No, because now we're almost there. Silly Willy. Hold on. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? You did better than your tight-lipped man here. You'll never say anything again. We've told you everything. Won't you let us go? Aver, there you are. What's with the prisoners? Man from the fortress, out on patrol. We squeeze them. Berger's not here. It's his queen they're guarding. Others with... They must have separated off the Tomworth. I heard as much from Chaelbert in Lerichester. Chaelbert? What was he doing there? Ivar. Too long a tale for now, but he's fine. I send him to Repton. What's the plan here? It won't be long before someone comes looking for these men. We need to get inside and find Adolf's with. Capture a queen to find a king. It might work. Only one way to find out. He might not Save really care about her. Any more out of them. Me and Aver will take care of fetching others with. Oh, then guide you. Although I guess he did send extra protection, so he must care about her somewhat. But does he care about her the enough won't to? Welcome us through the front door. <clears throat> we could find a quiet way in, or we can take a long ship. I'm beside you either way. Ah, oh, Aver. I have Let's dreamt of this day. Try the guy in the Shire in search of a king. <laughs> of going a viking good. With you. With our brothers and sisters. <laughs> conquering new lands. Forming lasting friendships. And if it takes chasing some weasel across a new land, so be it. I am right where I wish to be. As am I, brother. Mm -hmm. That's sweet. Alright, there's a guy looking out right there. Is there anybody else around him though, or can I take him out with my arrow? I think I can. I should be good to go on that way now. I must be careful now. Shit. <clears throat> okay. Sneaky. <laughs> Stealth mode. right there. Hmm. Maybe in the tower? That seems like a pretty defensible position. Come on, Sigurd, climb with me. Okay, this tower does not have a hole in the top. Survey the area soon. Sigurd? Okay, clearly he could not climb the tower. Hmm. 
Apparently I have already looted this place too. There was a giant door I couldn't get in. I wonder if she's in that giant door. If this is the place I'm thinking of. Actually, it might not be. Oh, wait. Yeah, right there. I don't... Okay, these people are pretty oblivious. I'm, I'm a fan of that. Can I slide? Yes, I can. Oh, shh. Okay, good. <gasps> Do I have double assassination? Damn it, I was hoping I'd take both of them out. It was not the case. Ooh. So much for my stealth plan. Pathetic. More like you like being defeated. With your crossbow? I don't think so. I can do that too. Hey Sigurd, where are you? She's gotta be in there. There's like lots of people over there. Hmm. get to that. Oh. Who saw me? I want to get to that rope. Oh, it's over there. Okay. Um, hmm. I'm going to do this. Take you out. Why can't I get you? What the heck? He's just invincible, apparently. Where'd Sigurd go? <laughs> He's just gone. He's just doing his own thing. Oh. What? There was not. Oh, there. 
That's bullshit. Bullshit. Hey, 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 hey. Don't attack me when I'm stomping. Oh, fuck. My parry time is just off right now. Nope, nope, nope. All right, you. Oh, no, I'm out of arrows. I need to switch my bow. Stop it! <laughs> Stop shooting me! Oh, there we go. Maybe I... Call in reinforcements now. <laughs> I want to redirect it. <laughs> That's amazing. I can see the timing on that being horrible, though. All right, where is this chick again? I can't open that door. I... Oh, there it is. I was gonna say, I could have sworn I saw the blue circle. What? Don't jump away from me. Work with me. Why, why do you keep climbing around? Stay still. Goodbye, head. These people are just like spider monkeys jumping all over the place. Remain steadfast. Got him. This seems promising. You three, scurry. Oh, nice of you to show up, Sigurd. Lady Athelswith, I see Burgred has done his best to hide you away. But what is lost must always be found. Let my handmaidens walk free of this place. They have nothing to do with our quarrel. You hear that, Eivor? No. Selfless. This is the sword you must strike a bargain with. A woman of quality. We seek only your king, lady. Tell us where Burgred hides, and we will leave without an ounce of blood spill. Besides Please. the ones we've already killed. I don't... I don't know. Effective, Sigurd. She is only naive to her present danger. But she will soon understand. Wait. Those are the hands of one who washes linens. A servant. She is a decoy. Oh, God. Come quickly. The Danes, they found me. Tricky, Watch tricky. I'll follow Athels with. Listen, lady. You have no guards left. They've been slaughtered. 
Well, that's pretty smart. Some Star Wars shit right there. What? Okay. I'll catch up to you. I probably can row faster than you can. Although maybe I should take that big boat. Come on, row faster! Or pull faster? What do you call this? It's not really rowing, because isn't she pushing herself across the ground? <clears throat> oh, I got you now. Hey, Bart, you don't need to put down. Chuck it, and let's go. I don't think I will, actually. My husband will send you all to hell. Really, honey? Probably not what you want to be saying right now. Just, just gonna go out on a limb here. Stop what you are doing at once. No. I don't think I will. Don't you dare put your hands on me! Quite clever, your ladyship. You're certainly making us work for it. Keep your hands off me, pagan! Have you lost your sense of hospitality? I regret asking. Let me go! I demand it! After what you put me through, I would have to be mad. Do you understand what you're doing, pagan? I am the Lady of Mercia! Not for long! <laughs> you're wasting your time. I won't talk! Not to you, not to any of you barbarians. You may reconsider, mm. if only for your people. Who knows how many more might die at the hands of us barbarians. You don't frighten me. Then you are a fool. <laughs> One Lady of Mercia. Lady Arthur you have seen better days. Oh, ouch. God will sear your soul, heathen, if he can find it. She likes Why, spinning, doesn't she? Sees as much a poet as you. Where's my Catelyn? What have you done with her? Your handmaiden, you mean? The brave one, dressed in royal finery? Season change with the others. I'll take them back to Tamworth. Get them talking. If she has so much as a scratch on her... I will inform Cheerwolf. He might have some ideas on how to get through to her. I will meet you there. Sigurd, what about these prisoners? We've got what we need. Let them go. Alright, if I let them go, are they gonna attack me? Oh, blessed am I for your presence. Okay, run away now. Goodbye. Mm, skills. And I was working towards that. Nice, just enough. Ooh, that's cool. All right. So shit, I missed. Hmm. I'm just gonna go back and get that because there isn't really a fast travel point over here. And then I'll, um, 
then I will fast travel to Tamworth. Actually, let's go swimming with my horse because I think there's an achievement to swim a certain amount with your horse. <clears throat> oh, too shallow. That must have been underground somewhere and I missed it. I don't know if I remember how to get in there. Oh shit, really? Okay. Also, it looks like it's just in there, so maybe it's not underground. I just missed it. Hey peeps, what's happening? Oh, damn it. Should have run, Robin. There it is. What do you got? A cloak. so I don't have to do that again. <laughs> All right, nice. So, let's do, I think she should have time for another main mission. Your turn. She won't talk to me. Ava will handle it. Go on. Okay. Handle everything. Might as well handle this too. You exhausted my friend Abba here, but I'm wide awake. Abba. I Maybe keep saying Abba. Maybe tell me where hiding and let him rest happy. Never. Stone-faced and tight-lipped, all for a king who hides like a cowardly bull. Too scared to protect his family and his people. Thirsty. My husband does what he must for Mercia. How could he do otherwise, knowing that even his closest friends could betray him? Give that traitor Cheowulf my message. He may win this earthly battle, but the devil has won the war for his soul. He stabbed you in the back, true. But the people of Mercy are scared, and Cheowulf offers them a balm for that fear. I spit on him. Whatever life he makes in Mercia will be built on the graves of the nobles who gave their lives to defend it. The longer you drag this out, the truer that becomes. We've taken Repton, Tamworth, now Templebroch, and Lerichester. With each victory, your hope for peace recedes. Yet Borbred has what you do not. The loyalty of his people. Good men. Faithful men. Who? The Thanes and Cheols of Mercia? No, no. Only Leofrith remains loyal, and he too will fall. Yes, goodly Leofrith. He will die defending his king. And win or lose, he will send a hundred more of you to hell. Eivor? Your ladyship? Do not mind me. Only here to count my spoils. Oh, God! Oh, God! No, Piggy, no! Oh, no.
out, Ivar. Now. All right, all right. But if you mean to stay, mind the smell after they finish this. My... my god! Get me out of here! Please! Talk now, and we'll draw you a nice warm bath. You... You are asking me to betray my husband. How can I do that? If you don't, you will betray countless others. In legend, you may be remembered as the king and queen who abandoned their kingdom in its darkest hour. But there will be peace. This is Cheowulf's promise, and it will be honored. You have my word. I was gonna say, to be fair, we don't want to kill him. We just want to dethrone him. Although I have a feeling we're gonna kill him anyways. Does the caged bird sing? Burgred is hiding in an old crypt to the south, where the Alni and Aero rivers join. A crypt? Now tell me this is not a sign from the gods. It's a long way to carry a king. The three of you must clear a path back to Tamworth. Where can we meet? Bring him to the bridge at Venonus. It's a straight line through. We'll deal with any trouble there. Are we gonna give her her bath or what? The heads were a nice touch. I'm not one for spectacle, but it got her talking. Spectacle? I didn't like That's it, but it me. worked. Whoever trains these Mercian soldiers should be relieved of their duty, I think. Can we take them to, like, we said we'd give them a bath and a different spot to stay. Can we do that, please? <laughs> All right. Excuse me. South of Leicestershire. Leicestershire. Where the Arwe and Alney rivers join. So... Where are the names? The Soar River, the Brant River... Alright, so it's south, so it's gotta be... Alright, there's the Elni. Where is... Here, well, Neen River? That's not it. Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, my phone is buzzing like crazy. <clears throat> okay, so it's gotta be here. Oh! That makes sense, it's the place I couldn't get to. <laughs> okay. Uh, so I'll fast travel here and then I'll ride down from there. Oh, that's cool. Your enemies become stressed and more alert after witnessing... I don't remember the exact verbiage, but like a scary event. A stressful event. <clears throat> oh my gosh, so this place... I came here because I was trying to get that achievement where one of those brutes chucks you a certain distance. And I watched like a video and someone said that this was a good place for it because there's a brute on top and if they just chuck you off the edge, the drop is the amount of... Um, the distance that you need. Really, horse? For real? Anyways, so I came here. I climbed up. He's like on one the tops of one of those things over there. That one with the tent on top. I'm pointing like you can see where I'm pointing. Um, yeah. Killed his little friend. And the first time he like belly bumped me off instead of threw me off so it didn't count so I Something is wrong. went back up Foul. and he tripped and fell off the edge you might have seen my tweet I shared the video so then I was like awesome well then the game glitched out and he stayed dead for like days I did so much stuff and he was still dead and was not responding you could see his body just on the ground finally he respawned so I tried it again, saved it right before I went up. Thank God I did, because he tripped again. 
and I'm not even kidding you, reloaded my save and tried it again, tripped again. The dude fell off the edge three times. Three times! God for a musty crypt. You cannot be <sighs> the dead they're protecting. But I finally did it. It was successful. It just took me a while because the guy was a moron. I'm like, all I want you to do is actually, like, damage me. And you can't manage that. Ooh, got him. Nice. I couldn't really tell the depth on that, so I wasn't sure if it would actually work or not. Can we get on the tree, please? Hey! Fuck. Not the that was free. not the plan. It worked. <laughs> but I wanted to assassinate them. <clears throat> Alright, you got some food I can eat? I cleared most things in this and was very frustrated because I had to, couldn't get this last thing without being in a mission, I think is what it was. Right, okay. I was like searching all around, I felt like an idiot, I'm like what am I missing? So I looked it up, I think I needed to be either in this mission or complete this mission in order to get it. Close. It's to you. These people are oblivious, huh? God damn you, my lord! No! Why would he put the no, lock no, on the outside of the door and not the Stay inside back. of the door? <laughs> what the heck? That's a bread knife, my lord. Do you mean to butter me? <laughs> stay back! Back, I say! I'll fight you! If you insist. Oh, man. You'll have to kill me! Luckily for you, it won't come to that. This kingdom is mine! Mine! Ooh, uppercut. The throne is mine! Don't kill him! Alright, thank you. Where's your armor, dude? Time to go, my lord. We're uh -huh, late for the crowning is. ceremony. As per your request, I made some alterations to the Dane axe you brought me. You will notice the grip, throat, and belly have all been tailored to a man of your stature. Wielding it will require a bit more effort, but I am sure you will get used to it quickly. And as always, I've given it a proper sharpening. You'll split hairs with it, so do mind your fingers. I hear this is the same axe they pulled from your shoulder. Fancy that. Give my regards to every Dane you cleave it with. You cleave with it. I will check that out later. Oh, don't put him down. No. in there. Or just a way out. Hmm. 
Nice. Quicker exit. <laughs> no, put him on the horse. this thing I'm just gonna chuck him around you, you, you think you've won you haven't liar Frith I, I sent him away with orders to destroy you quiet the mess you're in you don't know the half of it I'm sure you'll tell us. You're a blight on this world! The whole lot of you! A rancid disease! You don't deserve Mercia! To the victor the spoils, my lord. You must win Mercia to the server. <laughs> I know I say this every time I have someone on the back of my horse, but I would be so sick. Bouncing up and down like that. Probably take the wind right out of you. I can jump this. Hey, boy! This way! We need to go. Fast. Right behind you. Hmm. Okay, so we're still going. Are we getting chased or something? Why do we need to go fast? Oh. Ambush! Goodbye. <laughs> Leaving you in the dust. Until I get to this hill, and then you're gonna catch me because I run up the hill like a grandma. Come on, horse! Oh god. Oh god! Slugs! You won't get away with this! I'm not a slug. Look sharp. Called a cow, called a slug. Change has come, Burgred. All that Were those his people that were doing that too? A witten with the Lords of Mercia. Burgred, my love! My lady! Are oh, you injured? he does care about her. Did I hurt you? No, no. I'm fine. Move along, Lord. Your king awaits. Your death will come, Danes. Your end was writ the moment you came for me. I have made damn sure of that. The zealots will know your name soon enough. No matter where you are or how far you travel, they will hunt you down. Enough of that, you squeaking sparrow. <laughs> <laughs> Let my brother be the lunatic of Tamworth. Zealots? What does he mean? Ignore him. Desperate pleas and prophecies, nothing more. Walk with me, Wolfkist. We have some time before the ceremony. I don't want to. I don't like you. Where to? Nowhere in particular. I only want to celebrate. Didn't think you were the type. You have brought oh, sorry, a part conclusion about me, haven't you? That is all well and good. I've drawn some about you as well. Are you leading a land to slaughter? See what I mean? Dark. Too dark. Says you. You there! Get lost! <laughs> Sit down.
I know I have been a cock. But <laughs> you are a good fighter. I respect that. Let it be said that Ivar the Boneless considers Eivor a friend. Who calls you boneless? Some background I killed in Hibernia. Used his guts to shine my spear. Called me boneless because I move like a reed in the wind. Please don't ever Not do that again. you're always too drunk to plow. <laughs> Valhalla. Ouch, that Eivor. Is where I am Ouch. Back. I can smell the blood and taste the mead. I will sit beside the high one with my axe in hand. A fitting end for Ragnarsson. You would think, eh? Me, Hafton, we will be there. <laughs> Didn't I call him Hafton when I was reading? Oops. No. I do not think we are chasing the same victory. Not anymore. What does Abba want? To grow old and fat on the farm somewhere with little Ubers to chase him. Aww. He wants an heir. It's a common dream. Not for a warrior. Not for Drengir like us. He was different before. But this place, England, it softened him. People change, and it may be that you change with them, or you go your separate ways. If it bothers you so much, why not strike out on your own? Because he is my brother. I love him. And I will do what it takes to drag him back around to my way of thinking. I don't like we how are that warriors, sounds. All. And that is to the death. Don't like the sound of that one bit. <laughs> I hope a pig poops on you. I just don't like him. I know, like, clearly I don't like him because, like, He's just bloodthirsty and seems crazy. But also I just don't trust him. I don't I don't like that he keeps putting Chael Wolf in danger. I don't like that line that he just said about Abba or Uba or however you say that guy's name. Out it myself again. Did I miss the crowning? Alright, I guess we can do the crowning part. What is this? How much did we drink? <laughs> what the hell did we do? Is there anything else I can do? He's worse off than I am. Wow, we're still pretty drunk, aren't we? Alright, let's do this crowning and then I will stop there. Oh, talent points. Let's see, what was I working towards now? Don't remember. Oh yeah, that one seemed cool. Pardon me. Although that seems really cool too. That takedown thing. Let's go for that. Okay, so I got a long ways to go to get that, but that seemed cool. We better sober up before this coronation. Where is my son? We sent word to Repton, but we've had no word, Lord. I suggest we carry on. Oh, 
His tattoos are so cool. <clears throat> You sought me out, old friend. And here I am, standing before the throne from which I reigned not long ago. You stand before us to accept this Witten's unanimous decision. That you are unfit to rule, and are hereby deposed. We demand the abdication of your kingdom and your crown to Thane Chairwolf. Mercia has spoken, Lord. The crown. Is that you, old friend? Ah, yes, I see it now. <laughs> Forgive me. The robes of righteousness sit so loosely upon your shoulders. If the heavens he mismark me as king, forgive its obscuring light. Amen. Now, where is my crown? Forgive my nerves. Here I am, an upright <laughs> man who never once learned how to bend the knee. And yet, I shall try. Ah! <laughs> How simple it is. How easy to kneel without fear and feeling. He's mocking you, man. I'd kill the fucker. <laughs> Worry not, Dane. I shall resign this crown and this pagan-infested kingdom and the favors of these two-faced men. But I will do so on my terms. My demands are simple. Firstly, you must. <laughs> Bitch slapped. You fool. Look around you. You have no leverage here. Plead for your life, for it is the only thing these men will grant you. Yes. Yes. Forgive me. I. I do not harm me. I beg of you. Please, I'll go anywhere. Here, I, 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 I resign it. Here. Something fishy's Take going this on. Lord and his wife to Rome. He is hereby exiled, never to return. The Witten recognizes King Chairwolf of Mercia, second of his name, a just king. A merciful king! God save the king! You better be worth all this trouble. Mercy and soldiers marching on Repton! Leofrid, loyal to the ugly and the bastard. Gather what men you have and split them between the north and south gates. That should divide his forces. Cheobert is there. Eivor, you must save my son. He'll come through this, I promise. I will stay here with Chiovo. Go. All right. Okay, I'm gonna stop there. Um, I knew something sketchy was going on. I guess it makes sense that um, his second in command guy would attack Repton, but I still feel like there's more to it than that. Um, and like I said in the video, I don't have a good feeling about Ivar. Ivar. I don't know, I just, I don't like him, so that could definitely just be what it is, but he just made a couple comments and done a couple things where I'm just like, what are you up to? Uh, so I'm curious to see if anything comes of that or if it's just my feelings kind of clouding my judgment about him. But I'm really liking this story arc. I think this is, I liked Soma's story arc, like the betrayal and stuff like that, but um, I don't know, I like this one because it's more like kind of guessing what's gonna happen. Um, there's clearly, a bigger picture at hand and I don't quite know what it is yet so uh, I'm enjoying this more because I'm trying to kind of figure it out with Soma's it was you knew there was someone who betrayed her you were just trying to figure out the betrayal but with this it's like they're not saying there's something more going on they're just kind of alluding to it so 
I'm curious to see if that is an accurate assumption or not, um, but I'm definitely enjoying this area and enjoying this story arc so far, and I hope that you are as well. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit that bell button when you do so that you know when I post the next video, and as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it and hope you have an amazing day.